Hey guys, welcome back to Punches Season. And in this video, I will be playing against the computer. And remember last time when I said the level 1 computer was just for like stupid babies? Well, actually, it's not just for stupid babies. It's the perfect bot if you want to improve against Stockfish. So in this video, I'll be playing level 2, 3, and 4. And I'm telling you, those guys are actually savage for me. And I'll be showing whatever happens. But I will not stop playing until I have won a match. So I'm going to keep it a 5 minutes with a 3 second increment. I think that's what an increment is. I actually don't know what an increment is. So I'm rated 948 on chess.com. And I'm playing against this guy. But actually, I played against him a while ago. And it turns out he's worse than the level 1 bot. So I suggest the level 1 over this level 2 guy. Anyways, let's get started. So I'm starting with the Intercontinental, which they fell for last time. And I think they will this time. But actually, no. They're on aggressive attacks. Alright, so I'm going to play here, protecting my knight from the queen. Okay, okay. Well, he's playing well. Alright, he decides to attack the queen. I'll move away to safety. And I might as well. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, he is attacking the queen. Uh, I know exactly what to do here. Exactly what to do. Stay there and don't give a damn shit. I mean, stay there and don't give anything. Not even a damn. Alright. Okay, so we'll continue now. And we gotta go fast. Because there's only three minutes left for me. Okay, okay. You made your move. I can see that. I'll, uh... Move my knight attacking the queen. That way forcing him to take it. Oh my god. He just, I think he blundered his queen. No, he did not. He did not blunder that queen. Oh my god. He just left this queen blundered. He just blundered a queen. I don't know why people blunder queens out these days. Oh, that's why. And soon, he'll probably discover the attack and uh, forking my queen and, you know. Okay, he just gave up bishop. You see, he's playing a little bit worse than the usual engine. So he's playing worse than the Stockfish level 1 engine. And let me tell you, this is great if you're a beginner. This is exactly the kind of stuff you want when you're a beginner. Now I'm expecting a capture. No, he doesn't capture. So this is the kind. All right, I won. You see, I won. Now that this boy's over, now this boy's over, and uh, now I'm gonna play against level three. And let me tell you, I lost to level three, man. Level three is savage. So let's play. Let's play. I hope I win this. I lost last time. Oh, he starts off fast. Okay, both play fast. Let's see if I can do a scholar's mate. He blocked it before I even threatened. Wow. Okay. I'm expecting him to capture with the... Oh my god. I knew that. I knew he could capture with the queen, but I did not expect him to do that. I was not expecting that. Anyways. Let's move over here. For no reason. Oh, he's trading queens. This is why I'm telling you, Stockfish 3 is a savage. Look at that. Now I can pin. 
and he will attack, obvious, or he defends a pin. Now I come back. What does he do? He can destroy me. I don't care how long this is gonna take, but I will not stop playing these stockfish bots until I win at least one match against every single one. Oof, that's a blundered bishop. Actually, you know what? I think I'm gonna resign at this point because, well, he's absolutely crushing me. Literally. He's crushing me. Look at that. Two knights out, head lead in development. He is moving savages. Yeah, you see, bro, I'm dead. I'm dead. So, let me see if I can do a triple fork. Oh, he fall for the triple fork, boy. Yeah, my horse is dead either way, but I'm going to do the most damage I can. Till then. That's it. Now I bring out this rook, not the other rook. I want to have a bad feeling about it. Okay, I'm getting a bad vibe about this, bro. This bro is giving me some bad vibes. This bro giving me bad vibes. Are you kidding me? He just straight up told me he's targeting the rook. What you gonna do about it? Well, move away. That's what I'm gonna do about it. Oh, hell. He literally got that. Might as well take his knight in the process. And, uh, train knight bishop, which I'm not very good with. You know what, actually? I'm gonna resign, man. He's too savage. So, it's victorious this time, but I'm playing a rematch. I ain't looping and stooping, and I ain't stopping either. All right, I'm gonna go into continental, which is my usual, most used trick. Because I taught everybody this in my first video. And I think he's going to fall. No, he isn't going to fall for it. I don't think so. Yeah, I, I believe he. Okay, okay. He does not fall for such tricks. Stockfish level. Okay, instant checks. And we're back. Okay, I just wanted the queen. I just blundered the queen. Hell no. Nah. But I'm rematching. I'm keeping rematching until I win these games. Against four, I don't know if I'll ever win against four, but I'm going to go Kings Indian. I'm going to go Kings Indian. Okay, yeah, central control. But, uh... My King's Indians got stuff going on. Yep, I finished it. I'm moving my queen fronty. She's fronty. I'll move this boy up. Hoping to trade. No. Okay, then I'll just take that pawn. It's a free pawn. What can I do? What can I say? It's free pawn. You don't deny free pawn. Okay. Pretty unusual, but I'll see what I can do about this. Oh, guys. I'll, posi I'll initiate positioning lockdown. Oh, good. He literally just took a defender on the queen. Now I'm going to go there and fork. Give out a good fork to worry about. Oh, there, that's a boy. That's a queenie promochi. Till then, I'll fork you. Look at this. So much time left. And. Scoop it up and net up. Oh, shit. Oh, no, my king's vulnerable. Super vulnerable. 
like pawns a ton of moved these pawns are moved by a bunch and stuff is really gonna go wrong hell no oh hell no I'm out here I'll do this capture capture it's a fair trade oh you don't even need it okay double attack on the queen okay well my queen is still defended so no need to worry no need to worry now run queenie she still got legal moves and a blunder the queen as usual it's a queen oh oh i did not see that coming and now he's attacking everything Oh god, I'm pawn struck. But at least I've got more powers. Right? Now I gotta start pushing for a queenie. Girl. You got 10, 16, I got 11. 11 is less than 16. In case you've learned math, 11 is less than 16. Oh my god, this central pawn is still alive. Central pawn sti never stay alive this long. Okay, you know what? Even if I lose this, I'm just going to play against Stockfish Low next. Oh my god. Oh my god. He is aggressive. That way, it's position lockdown. Oh! How did I not see that? Okay, this is why Stockfish Level 3 is a savage. Now, I'm telling you, I'm going to be playing a few random games next. You see, I'm going to be playing a 5-3 Blitz against some random people. Like, three games, and I'll finish it off. Like, not three games, I'll just play one game against someone random. And I'll completely end it. Yeah. Alright. So, it's waiting... You know what? I think this is just enough for the video. Anyways, every season's a punch of season. Remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Ring that notification bell for more amazing content. And comment on what you want me to do. I will be doing a shout out in the next video to a subscriber around here. And that's it, folks. Goodbye for today. So now you know why Stockfish Level 3 is a savage.